guys, Jasmine here, Star Diamond and founder of Team Rogue. Um, wanted to make a video about my experience with the newest workout that I've been doing. So much um, has happened in the last three weeks and I know a lot of you have been following my last 21 day uh, journey step by step. I tried to post every single day. And thank you first of all for being my accountability partners, for really being there and checking in on me and watching what I was eating. So I wanted to kind of wrap it all up with a uh, video on my personal review on it and you know what I thought overall. Um, so many of you know I have done numerous workouts with uh, Beachbody and I have completed, I mean so many, just so many. So the newest one when it came out, it was launched in um, about four weeks ago. It was launched about four weeks ago. And we were all super excited about this one. It was really, really an awesome workout. Um, everything again is from home. So I was excited because this was gonna be another 21 day workout where I knew that I couldn't get on board for 21 days. Who can't get on board for 21 days, right? And I was just coming off vacation. Um, and to be honest, you know, I kind of had hit a slump in my fitness. So I had told my family and my friends like, okay, I can get in with this one. I can totally commit to 21 days. And let's see what happens. So a group of us, um, actually, I think it ended up being nine or 10 ladies. So we all pulled together and we had our own accountability group and we were kind of like our test group for Team Rogue. So what does that mean? That means we were the first people in our team to do the complete program and track every single thing. We actually checked in daily um, with an accountability app we um, checked in on each other online. You know, if we heard someone going, going silent or we were struggling, we had our own little chat group going. So we were there to encourage and to help each other out. And of course, to complain because it's hard sometimes, right? It's hard to kind of, you know, busy moms, working, stay at home moms, running around with kids, PTA. You know, there's a lot going on in life and we totally get that. But we were all together in a group, holding each other accountable and making sure that, you know, we were all staying on track with our goals. So first of all, that was awesome. I don't know if I could have done it without that group of ladies um, because there was times when you just really want to quit. So let me kind of set up how this program works and this may be a program that you have interest in. Um, so let me give you a little bit of background and vibe on it. So long story short, it is 21 days, okay? It's kind of a boot camp style. Um, you do use some light to moderate weight. For example, I used um, anywhere from eight pounds to 20 pounds. Um, most people don't have 20 pounds at home, which is cool. Eight you know, to 15 pounders will work just fine. And again, it was just over progression of time that I was able to lift a little bit heavier. So the very first week, um, the workouts are six days a week. The seventh day is actually a stretch kind of recovery workout, or you can use that as your rest day. Um, it's again, it's up to you and what your body's doing. So the first week, they are 25 minutes. And what you're doing for those 25 minutes is one day is pretty much like a cardio day. The next day is a strength day, which you're using weights, cardio, strength, cardio, strength. So it's kind of that repetitive thing. You're doing the same workouts every other workout for the first week. Now week two, what happens is those 25 minute workouts now become 35 minute workouts, brand new workouts, but same concept. First day is a cardio, next day is lifting, cardio, lifting, cardio, lifting, goes forward. The last day is an active recovery or a rest day. Now, the third week, which was the most challenging for me, because you all know I love my quick workouts, was um, 45 minutes each day. So I had to totally really sit down and revamp my schedule because one, I'm really not a morning person, so I don't always um, like getting up early and working out. But with my family schedule and my work schedule, that's the only time I can really fit it in without feeling guilty of taking away my family time. So I had to kind of put the clock back even further on the last week to fit in those 45 minute workouts. Um, not always my favorite. Actually, one of them was like, I, you saw me on social media, it was my nemesis. It was so hard for me. But I have to say, I came out to be a stronger person because I stuck through it and I did it. So I'm really proud of myself for that and anyone um, who knows me in cardio, that wasn't the easiest thing for me. So I conquered it and I did that. So I'm really super excited about it. Um, so again, that becomes a 45 minute workout. So that is a three week plan. Now there are um, 
there are a book, there's a booklet, right? And so you have these little um, meal plans that you can follow. We figure out your calculations based on where you're at and you follow a meal plan. Now there is normally with Beachbody, they give you a list of allowable foods. Pretty simple, pretty standard. You can pick from that list and you eat per your, what we call brackets, um, which I help figure out. So you eat per your meal plan. But what I really liked about this one, and this to me was the game changer, was they gave you a sample meal plan for all three weeks. Grocery list included. I literally just printed it out and took it with me to the grocery store. I was in and out, like in and out with my groceries. Um, because I knew what I was eating. And so a lot of people ask, you know, you must spend a lot of money, how do you do it? Well, honestly guys, I ended up saving so much money doing this plan. I was, um, first of all, with our family, we're a family of six. The family eats around what mom makes and what mom's going to make. Now they might not necessarily eat everything I eat, you know, I do buy certain things, extra treats for them, but the base and the core is what I eat. So what I did is I just bought a little bit more for the family. And I am not joking, I think between the three weeks, I spent 125 a week or a little bit less. And that didn't include like toiletries or anything like that, that was the food. But $125 for a family of six, and it kept me on my game like the whole time. Now, I have, people are asking me, did I eat out? Did I, did, I personally wanted to stick to this plan as true as I could possibly. Um, so. The only thing, I did have a couple of treats. So like one Friday I had a, a small bowl of ice cream. Um, I think one night uh, we had friends over, so they brought over some In-N-Out burgers and they brought me a protein burger. And so yeah, I grabbed like three or four uh, animal style fries, but I walked away. Um, so those were the only things that I ate that was outside of what I cooked. Um, oh, I did have one bean and cheese chimichanga as well. So. Yes, those are the things that were off my list that I did have and I did enjoy them. So I don't have any regrets with that. Um, everything else I made from home. I did not go out. Um, actually, I didn't do any of that stuff. So I took my lunch to work. I prepped it. I had everything squared away. And again, guys, I spent $125 or less each week that I did this workout. Um, things that I ate, um, and I'll probably make another video on that, but you know, standard stuff that I have in my house, um, chicken, fish, ground beef, those are um, yogurt, uh, fruit, vegetables, um, potatoes at some point. So anyway, so I ate normal food. It's just how much of it I ate and and in what areas I ate it in of the plan, which really was the big kicker. So again, week one, piece of cake, not a problem. Week two, I was like, okay, you know, this is okay. I, I see things going. Um, my first week, I think I lost about four pounds. My second week, I lost one pound. Now I will say that it was that time of the ladies month here. So I was happy that I didn't gain and I actually lost a pound. And I, that was the week I did kind of have like the ice cream and the protein burger. So you can, you can figure that one out, but I still lost a pound. Um, and today was my last day and I took my measurements and my weigh in. So this last week though, let me tell you, it was tough. It was tough because uh, the meal plan adjusted a little bit. And this is a point where you, this is kind of where everything comes together. And at first this week, I was like, I'm not losing weight. What's happening? I don't understand. Of course, I started getting a little bit tired because I've been going hard for the last three weeks. Um, but today it was like, and it's so strange because it was the last day. Today was the day where I weighed in and I lost three more pounds. Okay, so this week I lost, so what's that, four, five, six, seven, so about seven and a half, eight pounds is what I lost total on this plan. I did my measurements and I gained some inches on my arm, which I'm okay with that. I gained some inches on my chest because, you know, of the pectoral muscles, so I did gain here. I lost around my waist, I lost around my thighs. Um, I think I lost a total of five inches from throughout my body. So to me, that is a win for three days. I was never starving. I was never hungry for anything. Um, I ate healthy, wholesome foods. Of course, I had my, my nutritional shake, which kind of tied everything together. I did not feel without. Honestly, someone could have been eating, you know, a, something awesome in front of me and I wasn't craving it. So I'm really excited about that. Um, but week three, I will say it kind of came and I was like, oh, here comes the wave of fatigue. It, I did hit that wall but I just pushed through. I made it happen, guys, and I'm pretty excited with my results. Um, so you have seen that I had like little agility markers, so that comes with the program as well, or you can buy them as well. 
um, let me think what else is needed here. Just the light work, the light equipment really is not much. I probably sweat the most in this workout than I have in a long time. So that was like, I told, I was telling my family, man, I have not sweated this much in a long time. So kind of getting me back on track because I had fallen off the wagon and I had just come back from um, my convention. And I think this is the exact program that I needed. Now some non-scale victories, which you know, I'm really, really huge uh, proponent of is people have noticed changes, obviously. So people have noticed that my arms are looking a uh, toner. Um, my, my bottom half is looking, uh, you know, my hips are kind of slimming down in a good way. Um, booty's lifting. I'm actually wearing shorter shorts. And my husband pointed out to me that I feel confident about I'm not kind of like hiding and, and pushing. I actually went to get my eyebrows in today and my uh, eyebrow lady hadn't seen me in about six weeks. Um, which is bad for my eyebrows, but she was like, what happened? What are you doing? Because you just look so skinny. Um, my mom hadn't seen me. My dad had seen me. They're just like, probably in a month. I know that's horrible, but they haven't seen me in about a month. Um, and they're like, wow, like what? And I said, honestly, this all happened in three weeks. So <laughs> I'd like to say it, it, you know, yeah, it's been six weeks. No, three weeks. I leaned out, I toned out. Um, meal plan is awesome. Like you can go get other meals from that meal, from that meal that you can make your own meals, but I highly recommend um, using the one that the program comes with for your first round, just to really get that jump start and that gauge. Um, and I am willing to help you, you know, figure that out when you do this program. So again, guys, this was an awesome, I give shift shop a thumbs up. Um, it got me back on track. It got me feeling confident again. It got um, started shredding me out. I was in a plateau for so long. I removed myself from a decade as far as the scale is concerned. Um, so I hadn't moved on the scale for so for so long. So I'm anticipating that I will be doing another round of this. So this will be a thumbs up for me. Um, I will take this on again and hopefully within the next week or so I'll be starting a new group and we'll take on round two. And now that I know more, I know I can push harder. Um, and I also know that it's going to be challenging, so I go in with my eyes open, but this is awesome. And I'm so thankful that I got to experience this um, as one of the first people going into this. So I'm going to be submitting my results online so I can get a free t-shirt, which I like. I'm, I'm, I'm kind of a, you know, anything for free, a t-shirt, and I lose weight and I feel good. Um, so yeah, so we'll be doing that. So that's it guys, thank you so much. Um, if this was valuable and helpful to you, um, if you have any more questions that I did not address, definitely comment below, let me know. Um, hit like for this video, subscribe if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet. But next round of Shift Shop will be coming up shortly. If it's something that you're interested in doing or you're not quite sure, that's okay. I've got tons of information that I can share with you. Um, but if you really need a jump start on your health and fitness, let's get you going. Thanks so much guys and we'll see you later. Have